the great thing about a London wall, if you're going to create one, you can call it whatever you want. I call mine the London wall because when we were in a hotel in London and oftentimes in hotels and different residences, they cover their walls with such great, great stuff. Of course, most of theirs are antiques and mine is sort of a mix of some antiques and some cool kids art but I just have to share and I'm constantly looking for some new little gem to put up there. It could be anything. If I found a cool necklace I would slam it up there because I think it would be just as cool. So mine is you know a beautiful mirror and you know a wonderful book that's opened up and just hung up there on a plate hanger. Um, these little gems you can find you know for a few bucks a piece. It's you know, they make these sort of things in Florence, and you find them oftentimes in flea markets here. Beautiful little tiny pieces of art and the horns, and, and then a shelf, and oh my goodness, look at this treasure, um, an Easter egg that still has something <laughs> in it that no one found. Look, no one found that Easter egg from Easter. We can have that later. And we even decided to put our television right in the middle of it. Okay, I'll open this. And um, also, I have to show you that um, some of my favorite treasures are our children's artwork. So I put some of their framed art up here, which fits to me perfectly, and it's, you know, takes the whole thing from being far too serious to, you know, being more about our family, which that's what it's really about. Again, the cool thing about a London wall is it can become anything you want it to be. I will continue to add stuff onto this, I'm sure, until I'm 95 years old, and probably you won't see any paint by the time it's done. And I know you're going to ask about the paint color, so I'm going to share it with you right now. This is a really intense, intense, gorgeous red. As you know, I don't um, have paint color numbers to share with you because usually what I do is take a little swatch of something and have the hardware store match it. It's a great way to do it. Find something in your wardrobe. Find a color that you are in love with and just drench a wall or a room with it and it will make the most delicious environment and you'll be able to create a London wall that will make your mouth water as much as jelly beans do. <laughs>